Welcome to another Photomagico tutorial. In this tutorial we will explain how to create map layers and animated travel routes. Here are a couple of examples. To create a map layer, open the map assistant. First you need to define the map region that should be rendered. Use the search field to jump to the desired location. The blue frame indicates which part of the map will be rendered. Click and drag one of the edges or corner points to resize the blue frame. Click inside the frame to drag it around on the map. By default the map will be rendered at the same size as the stage. If you later want to do a zoom animation on that map, the map image needs to be larger than the stage size, or the map will get blurry. Changing the zoom range makes sure that the rendered map image will be large enough to avoid this problem. Select the desired map type, before clicking on OK to actually render the map. You can modify the visual style of map layers by applying one or more effects. Experimenting is the key to finding a style that you like. Here are some examples. To add a travel route open the map assistant again. Click on route. You can create a travel route manually or you can load a GPX file that was recorded by a GPS device or a fitness watch. Let me first show you how to create a travel route manually. Click on the map to define the starting point of the travel route. Then click on the map multiple times to define any additional points on the route. If you want to move an existing point, simply drag it to the correct location. To delete a point hold the command key and click on it. To create a curved travel route, for example for an airplane flight, first define the start and the end point, then press the option key and drag the line segment out to create a curve. If you don't like the resulting curve, select undo from the edit menu and start over. If you want to mark important points on the route, for example cities that you visited, right-click on those points to mark them as waypoints. Waypoints will be displayed as larger dots. You can adjust the visual appearance of the travel route in the route style group in map options. Modify the line color, line style, and line width to your liking. You can also adjust the size of waypoints. If you want to display only part of a multi-day travel route, open the route segment group in map options. Adjust the start and end until the desired segment of the route is displayed in the stage. In this example we are showing the second day, of a multi-day trip. Please note that the part of the route before the chosen segment can be visualized with reduced opacity by clicking on this checkbox. To adjust the timing of the travel route animation, modify the animation speed curve. For example, drag in the start of the curve a little bit to linger on the start of the route for a while before starting the route animation. Drag in the end of the curve, to make sure that the end of the route is visible long enough before the slideshow advances to the next slide. Finally, you may also want to check out the documentation in the help menu to find out more about creating maps and travel routes. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next tutorial.